Hey, so I'm Richard. I'm going to walk you through some of the updates to Naptha, Naptha's tools and infrastructure. So some of you might have come across some of the different multi-agent frameworks um, that have become quite popular. So one of them is Microsoft Autogen. It's basically a framework where you can you know, create these different systems of agents and then it's mostly chat based so you can have like multi-agent conversations you can have like you know different hierarchical chats joint chats all this sort of stuff and what they provide is you know this library this sdk for creating these multi-agent chats another one that's quite popular at the moment is crew ai uh, again similar idea you know an sdk for defining these different agents and you know giving them tasks and a crew of agents which is basically just a multi-agent system um, and then you can get them working on these tasks. Of course, like the you know original one was Baby AGI uh, by Yohai, and this was a very specific um, type of multi-agent system. Um, you know, it had um, you know certain agents, and those those agents completed tasks. Recently, however, um, Yohai has been talking on Twitter about you know multi-agent systems, and he basically says you know. Um, what we actually call multi-agent systems are more like single agents with multiple modes. And the reason for that is, you know, they all use the same LLM. They all use the same code base. You know, maybe each agent has a different prompt, but it's really, you know, more like um, one agent putting many different hats on or having multiple modes. So what we've been working on with Napta is a SDK and nodes to build true multi-agent systems. So, you know, having agents running on different nodes, but communicating across a network to, you know, perform tasks or chat or like many different types of workflows. So the first thing we've built is, uh, you know, a node. This is basically just a server. Um, there's a bit more about it in our light paper, but it has a few different components. You know, it has the server, like I said, with certain endpoints that help the agents to communicate. It has a message queue for receiving um, messages. This is really important so that the agents can operate uh, asynchronously. Um, also like different types of workers. So we have a Docker worker or just a Python worker. The node includes like a local LLM with Olama. And then each node can, you know, download different workflows. And it has also multiple databases for, you know, vector embeddings or like just, you know, normal file system or even just storing like workflow state. Um, so that's our nodes. The That's kind of like the infrastructure component, the back end. Um, the front end that we have at the moment is the NAP, the SDK which is a library for designing decentralized AI workflows and agent systems. So the idea here is that you define your whole decentralized AI app in like one file, and then, you know, you press run, and then it deploys on this decentralized network of servers or nodes. So yeah, the, not the SDK is currently open source. We're planning to open source the node at some point in future as well. Um, I'm going to walk you through an example of what a decentralized workflow looks like. So as we mentioned, you know, Baby AGI um, was one of the original <clears throat> multi-agent systems, and also the creator of Baby AGI is talking about how we need to move towards true multi-agent systems. So what we've implemented is an example of Baby AGI um, as a true multi-agent system for the very first time. So there's a number of agents in Baby AGI. We implement um, all of these different agents as different modules within our system. So we have kind of like the Baby AGI, which is like the main orchestrator um, of all the other agents. There's the task initiator, the task executor, and the task finalizer. Um, they're all on Hugging Face if you want to take a look. Um, each of our modules basically just looks like a poetry Python package. Um, very simple. Basically just like one main file, which tells you how to run it. Um, each module imports the NAPTA SDK and defines you know, each agent, um, quite similar to you know, other multi-agent frameworks. Um, so this is like the main one. You can see it um, makes calls to all the other agents, for example. Um, just going into another one then, this is the task executor, for example. They all look pretty similar, right? So now I'm going to run it for you. So this is just our NAPTA SDK, the readme file, which you can find online. It tells you how to run all of the different multi-node workflows. I didn't mention, but we also, other than Baby AGI, we also have like multiplayer chat. This is basically just, you know, um, two different agents running on two different nodes, just chatting and trying to like count up to 10, which can be quite funny uh, to watch them fail. Um, the other one that we have are these like prediction agents. Um, 
we worked a lot with um, a project called Valerie um, and you know they're building the OLIS protocol for prediction. So we built a bunch of prediction agents for them. Uh, and now we've also got like a multi agents prediction workflow, which is like systems of these different prediction agents working together uh, to you know predict whether certain events are gonna happen in future based on natural language. Anyway, I'm gonna run this uh, multi-agent, true multi-agent baby eye workflow for you now. And you can see it's created the baby AGI flow. Now we're on task one, the baby AGI task initiator on this node, node zero. Um, it outputs something, then it goes to node one for the task executor. You can see some outputs as well. The task, by the way, was research the history of football. So the task executor has, you know, um, done some research. And now we're on to task four, the baby executor. And so you get the idea. But um, these agents are running on different nodes, right? Um, we actually only have two nodes at the moment, node zero and node one, but um, we're spinning up more so that we can have each agent on a different node. So yeah, that's the demo, Baby AGI, um, the first true multi-agent system. And we're looking forward to you know many different use cases other than Baby AGI as well.